Welcome back to Party Guys. We are back with Control. So, in the last episode, we went and played with the jukebox. Now we're uh, about to go meet our bro. Lots of errors on this phone. Been 17 years. Uh, where is he? Probably in the thingy room, but. What's got going on over here? You're really setting up shop, aren't ya? They're endangering us by bringing a hiss in. If Trent is um. still around, he can stop. Let's go see what we've got going on. The resonance emitted from the HRAs is purely antithetical to every variant of the hiss signal I can arrange. But how did Darling create it? Hi, where's your gun? No, it's happening. After all these years, Dylan is here. But am I too late? How is he? I need to know. He's clearly been affected by the hiss, but it's different than any other manifestation we've recorded. Okay. Maybe what makes you so special is genetic. He was a prime candidate. Or maybe it's Polaris protecting him, something else affecting the situation. I need to run tests. He seems more in control, more present. Okay. I want to see him. My brother. Or is he? Of course. Now, Marshall set up an HRA warded cage to contain him. It's on the upper floor up the stairs. Okay, okay. I need to go. Jesse. Alright, bye bye. Be careful. I mean, you guys were telling me not to let him out. It, you're perfectly fine. Why do you think that this would work? Why would a freaking cage work on him now? Uh, where is it? I guess it's through here. This is where the guards are. What are you chanting? Uh, Dylan? Bro? Why are you floating? Shit. That's Dylan. Can you hear me? Oh, come on, my Dylan. I'm here. I found you. You've always been in there. Do you know who I am? Oh, you know me. Say it. You are Dylan Faden's sister. He's talking in the third person. That's good. Always a good sign. Yeah. Do you know who you are? Not Dylan. Trench and Darling made sure of that. I'm P6. P6. But I'm better now. The hiss made me better. Push the fingers through the surface into the wet. You've always been the new you. You want this Can you to stop be true. Please. <sighs> Not exactly the reunion I'd hoped for. It feels good to say those words. I want to say them. All right, they you're loopy. Sound good. They make me feel good. Don't you want to say them too? No. Fuck off, no. You need to help me get this thing out of his head. If he is still in there, if there is anything left, you have to you. help me. You! You can't uh -oh. through the hole in you! We let you in, you've always been here! The only true! A copy of a copy of a copy of a copy! Stop it! Orangefield! Shit! Shit! He can see you. This is not safe. We found Polaris together with my sister when we were very small, in ordinary, in the desert, through the door opened up by the slide projector. Okay, so you remember. But she didn't help when Trench took me away. She didn't give me any powers. All the powers are my own powers. And <laughs> she didn't help when they locked me up for years. After the song time for a pause, we build new 
you till nothing remains. The air cracks and the truth will emerge out of you. You are home. The Bureau brought the slide projector back here with me. And the Bureau did what the Bureau does. They used it. Of course they did. found... They opened the door up to the hiss. That's the only thing I can thank them for. There. There it is. We stopped the Altered World event in Ordinary when we shut down the slide projector. And now the projector's here. I need a warm as a tune you can't stop humming in a dream. Baby, 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 yeah. Just plastic. So safe. Nothing to worry about. <laughs> Funny. I welcomed the hiss. I let it in. To get rid of her. The hiss set me free. Polaris is using you. The Bureau is using you. You are a puppet. You can uh -huh. almost hear our words, but you forget. If we shut this off the slide warm. projector, maybe, maybe that will stop the hiss. Maybe it's not too late for my brother. You must see the truth for yourself, Jesse. Sister. The horrible truth about the Bureau. Don't try that the sister nonsense. The better option. Go to the prime candidate program in the containment sector. I have the key card to get you there. Salvador wanted me to have it. Wanted? Bullshit. I saw what the hiss did to Salvador. What it turned him into. Oh, is that okay, category Dylan. six? I'll go. I want to see the truth for myself. I'll go. But only to look for this lie projector. You can help me. We can end this. You are a worm through time. You are a worm through time. The thunder's holding. I don't know what else I'm hoping to find here. Dylan, you gotta give me the key Dylan. card. Can we talk? I'd like to tell you about a dream I had last night. Off to a good start. Okay. I'm listening. I was back in Ordinary, before all of this happened. But in the dream, I was alone. It was just me. I was the only child. A girl. My name was Jesse Dylan Faden. But then the Bureau came and caught me, brought me back here. Lock me up. Have you ever noticed that our names, Jesse, Dylan, they could be girls' names, boys' names. No, Dylan's definitely anything. a boy's name. Don't you find that weird? I find that weird. Sure. What the hell was that? Is he trying to mess with me? No, Dylan is definitely a boy's name. I have never heard a girl called Dylan. Maybe Dylan's still in there. Maybe there's a way to reach him. I'd like to anyway. talk to my brother. Now keep doing it while it reds there. Dylan? Dylan would like to tell you about a dream he had just now. This again? I was going to be the new director of this place. I helped you get a job here so that we could be together. You were an office assistant. You'd make coffee and deliver the mail. And there was always plenty of work to do. And it stayed that way forever and ever. It was nice. Really nice. That's debatable. But here's the strange thing. The dream shifted, and none of it was real anymore. It was a game. We were in a game, and it was a fucking boring game. 
but you couldn't stop playing. And then it shifted again. Or, or maybe it was another dream already. Or, or maybe I'm just confusing them. But in this other dream, it was more like a musical. This is an ordinary song about an ordinary girl from an ordinary town. It's the ordinary story. She worked an ordinary job in an ordinary office in something, 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 something. Sounds like and the that's Crooked Man too. Remember of that dream. Maybe that's for the best. Yeah, dude, you are definitely loopy. Oh, oh for God's sake. How many reds are there? Maybe I can learn more about the hiss from him. Can we talk? I just had an interesting dream. Where is it with you and dreams? Oh, shit. That's fascinating, but let's talk about the hiss for a change, yeah? This dream was about the hiss. Uh that's all okay. I get. In my dream, the hiss had broken free of this prison, this house. I'd set it free. And the president himself was there to welcome us. He was the first one to take the hiss in. Spread the word. At first, many people thought it was horrifying that he was horrifying. But also, many people who heard his words wanted to welcome the hiss in. And slowly, more and more of them came around until the whole world was brought together by the hiss. It was wonderful. Okay. Thanks. I am very worried. For the record, that will never happen. Not as long as I'm alive. Oh, for God's sake. All right, once more, and then we're going to go look for this stupid Maybe thing. Maybe I'm just here to punish myself. Any new dreams you'd like to share, Dylan? I'm glad you asked, sister. This dream, like all dreams now, felt very real. Like reality. And reality now feels like a dream. Maybe it's all a dream. Maybe it's all real. Dream where my brother endlessly tells me about his dreams. <laughs> I was in a dark place. And there was a dark man there. His name was Mr. Door. <gasps> Alan he Wake. told me that there are many worlds, side by side, on top of each other, some inside of others. In one world, there was a writer who wrote a story about a cop. That's Alan Wake. In another world, the cop was real. And that would be Alan Wake too. Dor said he himself was in all of them at the same time, endlessly shifting between them. I asked him how I could reach these worlds. I wanted to bring the hiss there. But he didn't want to help me. He didn't like the idea. What did he know? I'm not wild about the idea myself. Yeah, so Mr. Dort, we actually met him in Alan Wake 2. He was um, Saga's father, I believe. Alright, so. Um. Oh! Nata! Alright, so we. I don't know where we're gonna need to go. Where do we need to go? Um. Panopticon, I believe. But no, it can't be, because it's down there. The little thing. Um...
Well, it's in containment at least. All right, let's go there. I should hopefully have the key card for number six now. Let's have a look quick. Why do these look the same then? Where am I meant to find them? I don't know where they are, but we'll 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 do it. Um Well then, um, so it looks like there is one in ventilation at least. Oh no, there's areas there that I apparently couldn't get to. So by the coolant pumps there and stuff. We need to go left. I think. No. Oh, wait. Ventilation is this way. Oh, there's Cho. This is one of Alicia's ranger buddies. I should find the others. Okay. Um. So let's see. Black. Black rock processing is behind us. No. I'm working blind here, people. Sick. <sighs> Janitor's office. I'm pretty sure we've read that one. We watched this one.
That's the reason they can go as far as Pepe Krauss. I should be able to go here. And look, there's even a mark where there should be a door. Am I being blind? They are very goodly. You need to scratch back. What would kill a bad day? Paska, mikä paska. Okay. So we need to go around and to the left. Hey guys! <sighs> right. So into the coolant pumps. Pump to the left. Bro, kicking me? Hello. Ah. How do you expect me to reach up there? TV. How would I get to the TV? Look, there's a hole by there. Ah, I need to get into the coolant pumps.
You're a fast fighter. Should technically be on the left. Ah. <sighs> God damn it. I did pass somebody. Hmm. Oh, we're crashing. I'm getting dashboarded here, guys. Ugh, here we are. Where are we? Uh. Ow, poop. <laughs> Alright, so this is where the plane is. Oh, I see a room over there. Alright, anyways, uh so we need to take a left. Oh the power plant, I mean that works too. Come 
one elevator. Look, bro, I can run faster than you're getting here. So, next one. So we're here. Black Rock Quarry. Don't really want to do that. But it's the only one on its own, so. Director Faden. What's up? Still curious, but what's at the very end there, though? Uh, where's next? Oh, let's go to the converters next. your butt down here. Processing. There's the Atlas. Here's us. Was there not one for that? I'll go to the Atlas one at least. I can go back from there. Really? Literally his name is Guy.
say they would stand a chance without HRAs. Okay, so that's that. Black Rock Press is in now. Now that's central maintenance. Oh, wrong button. Ranger squad Charlie Seven returned from an nope, there you go. Does that count? Because I did it. <laughs> Hang on. Uh, we are. We are level six now. For that. I want to do that as well. Let's do that one. Ah, oh, stand there. Right. Cool and. Go. How do you expect me to do this, Artie? Oh, no, that's it. Mm. So how do I get there? Ati, you sent me these tasks, but don't tell me how to do them. Fresh one? No? All right, um, down here, maybe? Power plant now. I'll go it down anyway, just in case. you expect me to get there? Hello again. 
again, Mr. Clog. You really ah. let yourself go. Oh boy, you really have. Okay, look, controlled remotely from that one. Aha! Okay, so we're gonna need two. I know that there are three other people. I don't know where the other one came off to, so... I sincerely hope we never meet again. I see your problem here, Ratty. open this stupid door for us. Oh, you need an electric thingy there. There's one. Oh, do you mean I could've just... Oh my god. This would've been so much easier. Check on our progress. That one, medical wing, containment. So this one actually will take us down to what's her face. Her. But guys, we're going to leave this video here. We've done a fair bit. 
I hope you've enjoyed. If you have, hit that like and subscribe. Let me know in the comments what you think. And as always, thanks for watching. We shall see you in the next video. Bye for now.